Hey, welcome back into the Anglers All Fly Tying Studio. I'm Ben Baxter. Today I'm going to tie up Matt McCannell's Massacre Midge. All right, we're starting with a this size 18 and a 2487 TMCO hook. We're also working with a dark brown. You can use pretty much any color in the book on this one. Go ahead and start our thread up front. Mount your tag. I'm using an extra small, this is an amber wire here. I'm just gonna bite this wire in on the side of the hook here. Wrapping back to about the middle of the bend of the hook. Coming back forward. I'm not trying to taper this too much because it's a pretty slim profiled fly. We're gonna go ahead and wrap our wire. seven wraps out of that just for your segmentation I've mentioned this before I like to tie in front of the wire and behind to really bite that wire in there so it doesn't move on me next we're using a real slim piece of Two millimeter foam. This is in tan. If you wanted, you could use a smaller foam. But I'm making sure I have a little bit of room up front here, so I'm not crowding the head too much and you could even use like a 1.5 millimeter foam on this bite the rest of that foam down don't want to bulk that up too much because we're going to add some dubbing this is slf dave whitlock dubbing this particular color is a helgramite I'm gonna do a really fine little noodle here of dubbing. Use that, and I'm gonna use a little half hitch tool here. to do a few half hitches you could add some glue do a couple more wraps before you tie her off if you wanted to and I'm actually gonna use my bodkin here pick that dubbing out a little bit It really buggy. I think that's part of the appeal of this particular fly. Kind of looks like it's got some legs sticking out on it. The scissors, kind of trim that stuff down a smidge. There you are, that's the Massacre Midge. 
uh, created on the western slope here in Colorado by Matt McCannell. Thanks for watching. Give us a like, subscribe, smash the notification button, and keep an eye out for some more videos.